you guys doing? It's time for another product review. Yo, we're gonna be reviewing the Jamaican Black Castor Oil Leave-In Conditioner Repair Cream. I'm very, very curious as to how this product will react to my hair. I haven't seen a lot of reviews or a lot of videos about this particular product. One thing first that I like about this product is how much is in here. I'm gonna get 16 ounces. I was right. This is 16 ounces. This is quite a bit of product here. Let's read some of the benefits um, on the container. It says infused with coconut oil, moisturizes and strengthens, fortified with Jamaican black castor oil, coconut oil, olive vera juice, and argan oil. Okay, let's read the directions. After shampooing, towel dry the hair, apply a small amount to damp hair, focusing on dry or damaged areas and ends. Comb through to ensure even distribution. Do not rinse style as usual let's go ahead and open this up and look at the consistency oh this is thick it smells like i'm not going to go through the it smells like another leave-in conditioner that i have i'm not going to compare it because that beats the purpose of this particular product y'all let me go ahead and get some hair clips out um and we're gonna go ahead and jump into this product all right, so, ooh, this is thick, very thick. So let's see. All right, very creamy, very, very creamy, much so like the Cantu leave-in conditioner repair cream, but creamier than that. Let's say if you take that particular product and whip in some coconut oil and honey you will get this particular product look and it it yes i love that it rubs in pretty well clear so y'all let's go ahead and put my hair down now my hair is a little over a week i don't know what this is this is this is blown out hair um my scalp for a change i normally don't have issues with my scalp but i think because the weather is cooler here in texas my scalp has been itchy baby and i normally don't get itchy scalp so more than likely i'm gonna have to wash my hair here under a month those of you don't know i've been waiting to almost a month to wash my hair uh, i'm not gonna make it to two weeks so let's stop complaining let's section off my hair and apply the leaving now normally i use water but I'm going to be using the Apogee's Carrington and Green Tea Constructor. I have my oil. So this is going to be my moisture. No. I do the liquid cream oil. This is my liquid. This is my cream. And this is my oil. Okay. So. Now what I'm going to do, y'all. I'm going to spray this. Girl, what? Is that a piece of fried chicken? What was that, y'all? I'm so silly. All right. The direction says a little bit. <laughs> we ain't going to do that. We're going to smooth in quite a bit. Okay? Okay. Hair oil. All right. And that's how we're going to apply the product, okay? Ryan Little. <laughs> All 
All right, I'm gonna continue to apply the leave-in conditioner. I'm actually gonna do this section smaller, girl. What the heck? Don't you hate when you're recording and you don't press record? <laughs> but y'all, look at my hair. Look at this side. I only use this product because I was using it as a leave-in conditioner, so it wasn't a styling product. However, I am loving the definition. Now, it's been a couple of hours since I, even the ends are curling a little bit. I am loving this. This is, you, you gonna be in my top five. You my top five hoe. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna edit that out. Maybe I won't. This is gonna be my top five products because this, this is good. All right, y'all. All right, you guys, I am back with my final, final thoughts on the Kuza Jamaican Black Castor Oil Leave-In Conditioner. So it's been a couple of days now since I've used the leave-in conditioner and baby, it is very humid out here in Texas. So of course my hair is looking the way it is. Um, but this product is absolutely great for four category hair. My hair feels very, very soft. It feels moisturized. Um, and I, y'all saw the clip before. I loved the way my hair looked like just using this product by itself as a leave-in. The definition was absolutely fabulous. I will use this as a styling product with a gel though, but just be weary when it's a little, it's humid here in Texas, so it's not gonna hold, but still my hair feels great, great, great. Um, I will be linking, if it's on Amazon, I will be concluding everything below in the description box. So yeah, you guys, this is good. This is in my top five for leave-in conditioners. So thank you so much for watching. And thank you as always to all of my new subscribers. Take care, bye.